What's going on YouTube? I'm having a great day. I hope you're having a great day. I'm having a great day too. And I hope you're enjoying day. I got a Lego Star Wars review for you today. Shit. Okay. I was, I was, I was trying to remember the names of the two Knights of Ren. Uh, well, I guess it was the name. This is 75284. Knights of Ren transport ship. Man, I can't wait to show you all the inside details. This thing is actually... Well, hold on. I took some of the little things from the DC collectible minifigures because I wanted it to look good. Those don't actually come in the set, but I figured it looked nice. And if, you know, this is what you see on the thumbnail, that'd be pretty cool. But I highly doubt it because I don't know how to set up. I don't know. But yeah, this doesn't come in, so I figured I'd just show you this. Kinda sad that we got Ray and just 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 Ray alone. I mean we could have got maybe a couple stormtroopers for her to also fight, but I don't know. I mean I would I would have liked two, maybe three stormtroopers, just regular the regular white troopers. Maybe the one transport trooper from um the red spaceship looking thingy that she also came in the $30 set $70 $595 pieces three minifigures Lego is I don't know what it is about the old like the larger like the more I guess the more expensive sets like you could say like the transport ship only comes with two minifigures I know it's a um Galaxy's Edge said, but you know, a couple of stormtroopers wouldn't hurt, you know, to help build your army. Maybe some, um, resistance troopers. We didn't get any resistance troopers in. Uh, I don't remember getting any in. We definitely didn't get any in the, um, what is the money? Yeah, the the last Jedi. No, yeah, we didn't get any of the last Jedi or the Rise of Skywalker. So literally, we got that little battle pack, which got three in it. So, well, damn. Well, I guess let me get Ray out of the way. She's quite white, so. Damn. Yeah. That's gonna suck. There you go. The front. Back. And, um, I don't know. This is nothing to do with the set but <laughs> i heard this this is fantastic new set not set song from a guy i honestly have never heard of um tom mcdonald people are stupid people are so stupid it's a good song, it's a good song. I, I i recommend it it's funny um damn it i knew i was going to forget their names kadark Modoc, Modoc, Kadok, I don't know, Kadok and Karuk, I think his name is Karuk, I don't, they'll be in the description, so you know, check it out, while you're down there, you know, hit, hit like, hit, 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 hit subscribe, you know, come on, actually, you know, you don't, don't, I don't want you to, you're not allowed to, you're not allowed to, you're not allowed to, this is good, this guy is supposed to be like the, Demolitions guy, the boom boom guy, the ask questions first and kick ass. What is funny is this guy, his arm, this arm is missing. So, I mean, he replaced it with a big gun, which, come on, that, that's cool as shit already. But if you look at the manual, it's on his right arm where it should be. But if 
you look at the back of the box, it switches. What you just heard is the rumbling of like uh, 15 million boxes. Damn, quarantine got me bored as shit. But yeah, on the back, on the back of the box, it has some switch arms, which I guess Lego wouldn't really know, because, yeah, it's just on the back of the box, not the manual or anything. It's just, I, I guess Lego wouldn't know, they would see it as just a, just a weapon, so why wouldn't he switch arms, but, no, that's his arm. I'm very glad they didn't do, like, the thing that they used for Cyborg in the Justice League movie. That arm piece, arm cannon piece. I'm really glad they didn't use that thing. And this is Corrupt. He is, I guess, the regular gunner sniper guy. He sits back. I didn't even show you the detail. Holy oh, shit. They, they both have just straight black heads. So, no need to show you that. Front printing, yeah, you feel the bombs and stuff in the back. In the front, I know I'm late on this video again, but you know, I was having a bit of a, <laughs> a crisis. I'm, I'm having that moment that everybody does where they're just bored of Lego or tired of Lego or don't want to do Lego anymore, but. I was depositing some money into my account, my bank, and I passed by Lego, and I was wondering, you know, maybe they got some new stuff, and maybe they got the uh, Hall of Armor expansion pack in early, hopefully, I don't know, I don't know when that's going to be released, it's starting to piss me off, but I stopped in, I looked around, fighting about... Uh, should I get the Batman Bat Mobile Truck thing? Should I get the Ninjago Skull Dragon? Or should I just leave? Or maybe check out the Nerf. I've really been checking out Nerf Arrival. That's, uh, I don't know, a little extra thing that I've been looking at. But I bought this. The whole car ride home, the whole third, the whole 30 minute car ride home was me. I had this in my passenger seat. I was like, you know, every now and then kept catching a little glance at it, you know. And the whole time I'm talking to myself, you know, return it, bro. And that was $75. Return it. You're not going to like it. Return it. Return it. But now that I have this thing in hand and built up in the figures, it's damn good. I'm not going to lie. It looks badass. It looks menacing as shit. Like, if I was Ray or Finn or one of the other characters and I saw this thing, like, in the desert speeding after me, I would shit my pants. Not gonna lie. This has now turned into an ASMR about Lego. Please like and subscribe. I need help. I need content. I need people to watch my videos. But you get a gun. You get a gun. You get a gun. You get, um... A spare black hilt and a spare black stud with the bar. Like that. So I guess if you wanted to build another gun, because, you know, more guns, why not? And stick it right, well, anywhere. You put it right there. On any side, any over here or over here, doesn't really matter. You can do it, only do that. But I didn't, because I got to... Review this, even though you probably already watched Jang Bricks and MR Productions review it. So, if you're watching this, thank you. I, again, let's get into it now. I can finally shut the hell up and get to the inside details. Cannot wait to show you the inside of this thing. But let me just show you the underside first. It's a phony! See, that's where I. If I knew how to edit, man, my videos would be so much better. Because I, I would do the Family Guy. It's a big fight. Phone. Yeah. Hey. Fuck off. Don't care. Why do I always get text messages? 
I don't get text messages all day, but when I start recording at like midnight, fucking people text me. Shit. Yeah, no inside space. You get a little, little hatch here for someone to stand. A little hatch here for someone to stand. You get a little medium-sized hatch here for maybe one. I don't think two. I highly doubt two people could fit in there. But it's there. Really does look good from the outside, though. Like, it's nice and plated. Looks damn good. You can. I'm pretty sure you saw in the beginning, but you can have cardio. Card. I'm gonna just call them cardio. Cardio. Sit there. You can take crooks blaster. Stick it in there. And, I mean, you can have, like, the other four. I need to get the other four. I didn't collect any of it. I just don't want to buy that $80 damn TIE Fighter, man. I just I hate over... I hate the uh, overpriced TIE Fighters. And I don't like to use that word a lot. Because, I mean, you pay for what you get. And Lego is good shit. But... 80 bucks for, like, a TIE Fighter. It just... I want to bricklink the figure, but the figure itself on bricklink is like twenty bucks. I mean, but at that point, you might as well just wait for it to go on sale, for fifty bucks, and you know, get another fin. Cause you know, John Boy, <laughs> John Bodega, man, motherfucker, man, he, he make me laugh. I'm not gonna lie. Like all the crap he says about Star Wars and Kathleen Kennedy, he makes me laugh. I want you to watch this back leg right here. Check this out. Oh, cool. The other four, other two, are pretty rigid, so they don't move as much. But not bad. I guess I should show you the other side. You get two spring-loaded shooters. There's the underside. All the tubes and gunmetal gray and black and all that goodness. Back, then you get two... The back, back, you get some thrusters. In the back, you get the side pieces. Nice detailing around the back. This, honestly, bro, like, if it wasn't $75, they honestly should have gave this, like, a $90 price range instead of that god awful Grievous Tie Letter. Which I still want to get the Grievous Fighter because it looks cool, but like, you know, 7 80 I think it was like 80 90 bucks. I don't remember. They should have gave that to this. Yo, you could have made this thing thicker. Which I'm honestly surprised, like, they didn't try to give it those clear Technic wheels so that you could roll this around on the carpet. Honestly, I'm very surprised they didn't do that, but if they did do that, people would get mad. Because of wasted space. And you could have just. Honestly. They could have made this thing cheaper. That's going to piss. And some people off. But I. When the rumor of a night buzzard was out. I was thinking like. You know. Something like this on the outside. But like. Hollow on the inside. And just like. Maybe like. Keep this here. The pilot. And maybe a gunner here. But like. Four just like Lego chairs for the other four nights of Ren to sit on, and then enough. You know, maybe this comes up and you can put the four figures in, close it, sit your guy in there, sit your guy there, and fly away. But new. No. Damn, I have been, I am probably the most negative person in the world. I try not to be negative, but like, you know. Well, that should be the end of this review. Of this negative Nancy review. Um, if you liked it, give me a thumbs up. If you didn't like it, give me a thumbs down. Maybe comment down below. Tell me what I can do better. If you're going to comment and learn editing, I can't. I just It's too complicated. So, hope you liked the review. You know, subscribe, stay tuned, and post. 
quite regularly. Um, can't say I stick too much of a schedule, but I try to. And um, I'll see you next time.